All right, folks, so you may have already tried my lower body push, upper body pull workout using just the band. At this time, we are gonna do the reverse. We're gonna do lower body pull, upper body push. So posterior chain lower body, anterior or front of the body on the other side. Sorry if I just hit the microphone and made a big thud. Um, you know the rules here, 10 reps as a beginner, 15 reps as an intermediate, 20 or more reps as, as an advanced. I'm gonna do 10 reps for the sake of this video to keep it short and let you know what you're doing. I'll show you how I choose to put resistance on, but you can play around with it by putting it over your shoulders or under your feet, whichever you prefer. I like to go uh, under my feet, doubling it up like this. You may prefer to put one under your feet and the rest over your shoulders, entirely your choice. So the exercises, <coughs> excuse me, we're gonna do today are the squat slash deadlift hybrid, the shoulder press, single arm, a staggered stance deadlift, really hit the glutes and the hamstrings hard, a push up, you can do that banded or without a band, a reverse lunge, and then triceps. You may need a door frame or something like that um, for the triceps, but there are many, many ways to do it. So what we're gonna start off with is a squat. So we double up the band and we put it underneath us. Stand up straight to start with. And this one, we are gonna go squat slash deadlift, really focusing on driving through the heel, squeezing the butt. Three, two, one, down. And power up, one, two, three. Smooth down, explosive up, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, one more time, 10. Now remember, every time take the tension off the band before you move. We're gonna take it under one foot now, up here, single arm shoulder press, counterbalance with the other hand if you need to, strong core. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one more time. 10, and then we go to the other side, take the tension off the band, switch feet, make sure it's centered in the middle of your foot so it's not gonna twang up at you. Three, two, one, up, abs tight, two, go, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one more time, 10, boom. Right, down to a staggered stance RDL. So we're gonna put all the focus on one foot. I'll turn slightly off at an angle here. So this time, I'm gonna place it under my left foot to start. Now the left foot and the left hip is the one doing all of the work. We've doubled the band up. I'm gonna put this foot behind me, but it's not really doing anything. It's just there for balance. I'm gonna lower myself down, hinging at the hips, and then squeeze the glute and push back up. Squeeze the glute, push back up. Easy. And you'll find four, if you haven't got enough resistance, then you can change your hand position on the band, go a little bit lower. Five, very, very simple. Six, seven, straight back, focusing on that hip. Eight, nine, one more, 10, done. So tension off the band, and then we switch legs. All of the load on that foot. Remember this one is here merely for balance. Down, stretch the hip, squeeze up. Down, two, down, Three, make sure you've got enough resistance on this. Four, stretch that hip, feel the glute. Five, six, seven. Remember this one's just here for balance. Eight, nine, one more time. 10, boom, take the tension off. Now we're gonna do a push up. You can either do this with no resistance or you can do it how I'm about to do it. Wrap it over your shoulders like so, down into a push up position and then we go. One. Two, control. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two more. Nine, one more time. 10, boom. Then back up. Reverse lunge. So, getting warm in here. Place it under one foot. Get some tension on it. Focusing on this foot that the band is underneath. We step back. Drive up, balancing on one leg at the top, or just use that back leg for balance. Three, four, driving hard through the heel of the front foot. Five, six, seven, eight, two more, nine, ten. And remember, you can always change the level of resistance by shortening the amount of grip you have on the band. One, Two, three, whew, four, five, six, 
Seven. Eight. Nine. One more time. And ten. Okay, triceps. Remember, you can either do this one over your head, standing on it behind, but my preference is to wrap it over a door frame or similar, like so. Set your shoulder blades back to a good position and then extend the triceps. Squeeze, one, two, three. Flexing hard, four, five. Big stretch, six, seven. Keeping the shoulder blades in a good position. Eight, nine, one more time. 10, boom. So that is our lower body pull, upper body push workout. You can alternate that with a lower body push or upper body pull workout every single day because it's not heavily loaded. So now take between one and two minutes rest before repeating that entire cycle over as many times as you like. I recommend about five as a minimum.